respective faculty and my fellow classmates. Assalamu alaikum and a good day to you all. Today, I am here to deliver my presentation in front of you and the topic of my presentation is the writ petition filed against Rimshim Police Town. Rimshim Police Town is a part of its mother company, Purbatra Rimshim Town. It's a land developer company and uh, it, it was registered as Rimshim Land Developer and Housing Limited uh, in 2015. After getting registered, uh, Rimshim Land Developer and Housing Society was uh, was doing its operation uh, as a Purbachal Rimjim town and Purbachal Rimjim police towns. And it was going good and after uh, uh, several period of time, we, the Rimjim town got the BLDA membership which means uh, Bangladesh Land Developer Association and also got the approval from NHA, National Housing Authority. After starting its operation, uh, everything was going good and at the same time the permission was uh, pursued from different authorities of the government regarding the housing companies and also building the housing. And in the year 2017, the company faced a writ petition against them uh, from a local leader uh, who was trying to stop the development process from the very beginning of the uh, company, uh, from the very beginning of the work. Uh, he filed the writ petition uh, mentioning that uh, Rimshim police towns were illegally filling up the lands and water bodies around the village and uh, showed up uh, and the company got defamed uh, for this reason and the company showed up in the high court with all the necessary documents but as it was too late to respond, uh, the company, uh, the high court uh, has already given the verdict and also it was uh, it went against the uh, Rimjim police towns. Afterwards, uh, the company appealed in the Supreme Court against the verdict given by the Honorable High Court and showed up with all the necessary documents as proof. And later, it was proved that the allegations brought against Rimjim police towns were false and the Honorable Supreme Court has issued a status quo in the year 2018 on this regard. As I am currently working in this company, so I have had this experience of the whole process and I, and I, I had experienced how the uh, lawyers and the legal team had handled the issue with the very uh, competence of their and also I have shown, I have, I have seen the uh, struggle of the company and uh, as it was my uh, very first legal issue faced uh, in any company or in my in any sector so these things uh, I, I just wanted to share with you all as my presentation as uh, the topic of our midterm was uh, is uh, was any kind of uh, legal issues that I have faced or any legal topics so here I am ending my presentation and also wishing you the very uh, good health uh, in this pandemic situation. Hope you will, you all will be well. You all will be fine. Uh, uh, thank you. Thank you all for your patience hearing.